Hey everybody, it's K Cakes World, and today we will be starting my Sasuke 38 predictions with the first part, which is the course. So let's get into it. So stage one. The quad steps are gonna most likely stay. The only thing I could see him adding is like an extra step to make it the quintuple steps, but I doubt that'll even happen. The uh, rolling hill will probably stay. There's really no need to explain that. Wind slider, I am much less certain though. I mean, if it did get replaced, I could see them having something similar. It's like the double twister or the wing nuts, but maybe on a track. And they could also come up with something completely new and different, which I might prefer. It depends on what it would be though. Alright, the Fishbone Kai was only introduced in 37, the most recent tournament, so I doubt they're going to change. The Dragon Glider probably won't get changed or replaced until maybe a total victory, if it's soon. I could see a slight modification to the tackle, potentially having like the competitors push the boxes on an incline. Or keeping the same track level and making the boxes slightly heavier. Maybe 250, 300, 350 kilograms. So that's an extra 40 kilograms on. But I would probably still choose the incline modification though. And as for the warped wall, it's the warped wall. So it's not getting changed. It won't be out of stage one anytime soon. And the time limit is probably going to stay at 88 seconds. Or round down to 85 or up to 90 since... There's hardly any changes. Alright, stage two. The rolling log, it's m most likely going to stay the same since it only made its stage two debut in 37, if you can even count that because of the rain. Um, salmon ladder, up, down, Nobori, Kadari, whatever you prefer to call it, is going to stay the same, most likely until we get a total victory. The spider walk could potentially get modified or even replaced. If it does get modified, I'd imagine that they would that they would make three or four or even more sections moving. And maybe even move the final part up and down for extra precision and timing on the spider drop. It's just a hunch though, so I'm not holding I'm not holding my breath. The spider drop would be the same thing with its half of the obstacle moving up and down as well. It, only if the spider walk happens though. The back stream is where I could see them making a change. I feel like the jet power would be increased back to Sasuke 31 levels and make competitors more fatigued as they move on. It would also help to bring back the speed aspect of stage 2. The reverse conveyor is probably going to stay the same and the wall lift will definitely stay the same. As for the time limit, it will likely stay at 100 seconds, but because of the potential backstream modification, it'll be more strict. Alright, stage 3. The flying bar is likely going to stay the same, but maybe with some larger gaps. I would also like to see a support that doesn't have the chain in the middle, just the bar itself. The Sidewinder Kai will probably stay the same. The Planet Bridge will probably stay the same. But if somehow it did get replaced, I'd hope to see the Chain Seesaw make a return in that spot. Maybe upgraded with four chains or four transitions instead of just two. The Cliffhanger Dimension will probably stay the same, except that the weather is cooperative. It'll actually work, unlike last time. The Vertical Limit Kai will stay the same, probably until... Another total victory. And the pipe slider might be modified with a longer track or replaced with maybe the bar glider. I highly doubt both though. And just like always, stage 3 will have no time limit. And stage 4, the spider climb will stay the same. Salmon ladder Jugudan will stay the same. And the rope climb will stay the same. And the time limit is probably going to stay the same at 45 seconds. Of course, until there's another total victory. Sort of like tradition. So, so those were my Sasuke 38 obstacle predictions. 
and you can comment your predictions in the comments below if you want. I would guess that the number predictions will be released once the taping dates come out. So hopefully later this month. So hope you enjoyed and as always stay happy and healthy.